We value these components that are running on the cell phone that bring more advanced microanalysis as, as PM, which is the equivalent of PC. So personal microanalysis or personal microscope. The analogy <coughs> is, is not just in the name. I think as we make these cytometers, these cell phone microscopes, these um, rapid diagnostic test readers, more available to masses through a very inexpensive platform like the cell phone without sacrificing their resolution, without sacrificing their accuracy and diagnostic uh, uh, value, then you're actually increasing the number of personal microscope users by several orders of magnitude. And that's the same thing that happened to personal computers in the sense that it was the cost reduction uh, that led to so much frequent use of these personal computers even our, in our pockets. And that led essentially to uh, something much bigger than the personal computer itself, which is the internet. So imagine that these things are connected and we are getting our hands into the micro world and potentially nano world with all these microscopes working uh, globally. Uh, that's going to build up a new, mi new network, new internet. And that's going to be the internet of the micro world. So I, I call it as micro internet. Right. And that's where I think opportunities uh, are going to really go beyond our imagination. And what we can do with today's internet is, is fascinating. It was more than anybody could ever have predicted when they were first thinking about sending messages across um, to cities by connecting them. But today we know it's not just email. It's much more than that. It's like you can predict uh, flu trends based on Google flu, flu based on the frequency of keywords. And that's only because of the massive usage of the internet and how we interface with it. And that's the same thing here. I believe uh, we will have a lot of opportunities as we make and deploy these platforms readily available without again sacrificing their power uh, from the benchtop system. Then we will have our hands into the micro scale uh, at a much larger scale than ever before. And then with the statistics of looking at this big data coming from these microscopes, these cytometers, these uh, personal diagnostic tools, what we can do with that is really going to uh, be fascinatingly exciting uh, for the next decade or so. Oh.